Hi, this is Meghnath. In this video, we're going to learn how to print factors of a given number. So let's take for example, we are giving an input of 20. So we want to print the factors for this number 20. So that is the numbers which divides number 20. So 1 divides 20, 2 tens are 20, 4 fives are 20, 5 fours are 20, 10 twos are 20, and 20 ones 20. So 20 is divisible by all these numbers. So we want to print factors of a given number, right? Let's take for example, you are going to enter number 6. So we need to print the factors for this are 1, and 2 also divides 6, and 3 divides 6, and 6 also divides 6. Now the logic that we are going to follow is now let's take I'm going to open MS Paint and let's get started now. So let me open MS Paint and let's see the logic that I'm going to write now. Let's take for example I'm going to enter the number uh, number 8. So what we have to do is we need to start dividing from 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and we will check with every number so 1 8 is divisible by 1 yes 2 yes 3 no 4 yes 5 no 6 no 7 no 8 is yes. so we will write a for loop from 1 to n and we will divide with every number the input and if the number is divisible by i value we will print that number else we will ignore it so we are going to use this logic to print factors of a given number so let's get started and as always i'm going to you can use any editor of your choice i'm going to use visual studio community edition so let's get started so first thing i'm going to write include header files include stdivo.h and also include include conivo.h and now I always write here author and I'm going to write my name and then I'm going to write purpose so so the purpose of this program is to read a number to read a number from user and print factorial factors of the number okay now let's get started so we will start with main method so let's start with main method so void main and always I used to write three things first thing is variable declaration variable declaration read input from user and last one is the logic now let's get started variable declaration the first step is we need to read the number from the user and let's read the number from the user int input and also we need to loop through from 1 to n so i value okay now we need only two variables and read the number from the user so printf I'm going to write here enter any number and then I'm going to write here uh, scanf to read the value from the user so percent d for integer and ampersand input and now I need to write the actual logic so I'm going to write here for I need to start from 1 i less than or equal to input I plus plus so we need to check if every number is dividing so the input number if input number is divisible by I value that is modulo division and we need to print that value so I'm going to write here printf I'm going to write here percent D I'm going to put comma space and I'm going to write here comma I value so here I'm checking this with every number from 1 to input I'm checking if that number divides input and if it divides I'm going to print that number and that's it and last we need to add get ch okay so now let's run this program and let's see if it prints the factors for a given number and let's run this now if I'm going to enter the number so let's enter number f number 20 and we can see here so 1 2 4 5 10 and 20 these are the factors for this number right so we printed those values now I'm going to close this and this is how we will write the logic for printing factors of a given number okay so that's it thanks for watching do remember to subscribe for more videos and do share with your friends
Thanks for watching. Have a great day.